I might be the only person excited for today's double upload. And that's perfectly fine. I don't think I ever told anybody else this unless you follow me on Twitter, but I am a humongous Mega Man fan. From the original games, from the X series, from the Battle Network series, the Star Force series, the Mega Man Zero series, the ZX series, and the Legend game, because we were supposed to get a second one, but we didn't. I love Mega Man. To be honest, I love the story of Mega Man. What originally started as a poop contest between two scientists ended up being the symbolic battle between good versus evil. And this symbolic battle has been going on for literally thousands of years in this world. And you know Mega Man, you know X, and you obviously know one of the most fan favorite characters, the most popular characters from the Mega Man series, Zero. Now Mega Man Zero, the game, the series, was a, a really slept on platforming game. In my opinion, it's probably one of the best platformers in history, to be honest. And how it ends the story, oh my god. If you don't know the story of Mega Man, Mega Man X, and Mega Man Zero, please do yourself a favor. You don't even have to watch this video. Do yourself a favor and just go find like a synopsis video of the entire franchise. I promise you, it is so good. But now that that's out of the way, welcome to Mega Man Zero slash ZX Legacy Collection. I think I already said this in the beginning. Shout out to Capcom for providing a copy of this game. These games are some of my childhood favorites. It sucks because they were only on handhelds besides the Zero Collection that was put on the Wii U, but the Wii U flopped. So we're gonna start this right now. And I just wanna say that I will be doing an, a full playthrough of the Mega Man Zero Zero series over on Patreon, but on here, we're going to be doing just this one video to show off what this game has to offer because they did so much with this. I haven't been this excited in literally years. You get to choose between the Z and the ZX stories. Now the Z story, the Zero story obviously came before the ZX story. The ZX story is a couple hundred years after everything that happens in Zero. The Zero story is probably the most important Mega Man series that isn't, I want to say, Mega Man X's four through six. I'm starting off with Zero. Oh my goodness, oh my God. So like I said, here you have the Mega Man Zero games, the entire franchises, Jesus Christ. You also have the gallery of all the official art key images and all that good stuff. To be honest, one of these might be the thumbnail. I'm not sorry. What's this music? Okay. Dude, it has literally every single thing you can ask for when it comes to art. Are you kidding me? Oh my God, it has this, oh, dog, dude. They have a music player in here too? No way, dog, uh, 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 uh. dog, oh my God, what? Many bosses from the games this collection appear in this mode. Oh crap, oh yeah, it's like a boss rush. They have like leaderboards and you can pretty much just storm through this game if you want to. It's literally just a boss rush. You play through the games, or you play through the bosses, and I guess whoever beats them, you have a world record. There's literally, it's a whole leaderboard to see who can do whatever in this. It's kind of crazy. There is none right now at the time of this recording, but I'm pretty sure whenever you buy the game, there is going to be one. I think the Mega Man S collection was done in the exact same way as well. But I guess while we're here, I may as well get into the nitty gritty, the gameplay. Apologies for taking so long. Like I said, the I guess I'm gonna start. I, I'm the footage that you see in this recording will not be the same footage you see on the Patreon because I actually want to do an entire full playthrough of all the games now that we have them on the Switch. So I'm excited, dude. They have the original story mode, then they have casual scenario mode where it's pretty much easy for you to go through and just play the game and play the story, which is great for people who just aren't good at Mega Man games. I'm trash, by the way. Oh my God. It has the same dirty. <laughs> Ew. There's no way. Wow. This looks like a 
a Game Boy filter game. <laughs> it's a 60 FPS though, so. What kind of monsters are these? Goodbye. Oh my goodness. They just killed them. A dead end? No, I feel a strong energy inside. This must be the place. Okay, leave this to me. Stay back. See you. You should go. I'll take care of them. Oh my goodness. This must be... This must be Zero. We found him at last. What? It's protected. What should I do? What? Watch out! Damn, you're not making it. We're cornered. We have to evacuate now. But we have no time to argue. Ah, Milan. Seal. Seal. Huh? You should use my power. You should have. You have no choice. Are they coming? What? Passy, if, if I do, you'll be... Don't worry about me. Remember, everyone is waiting for you for your safe return. I wish they had auto text on. Do they not have auto text in this game? They have auto text in this game. Okay, whatever. Okay, thank you. No, I should thank you, Seal. Goodbye. Oh, well. Welcome. The God himself. Let's go. Zero is here. Zero has been resurrected. Zero? Help me, please. Okay, so these are the controls. So, it's just, so this is jump, shoot, dash, no, dodge, pay. Okay. okay, so it's pretty much... I don't want to say it's it's like... I mean, it's kind of dated. This kind of... I mean, it's kind of cool, I guess. They all have swords and stuff in this game. That's kind of crazy. Let's keep it pushing. So I remember this game being a lot more... You got a cyber elf. Okay. I forgot about the cyber elves in this game. <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right, here we go. What? It's a dead end. What should we do? You, thank you. This place seems to be a prehistoric laboratory. We may be able to find a trans server which we can use to go back to the resistance base. So if you know from Mega Man Battle Networks, I mean from Mega Man X6, you know that this is Gates Laboratory. How nice this passageway has collapsed in. Should we go back? Stay back. Or stay back, yikes. Zero, no, run. You can't damage this thing with a buster. You're gonna have no choice. Rats. Huh? Use this, Zero. Who are you? Hurry, you have to save her. Don't waste time. You got the Z-Saber boy. There you go. The hell was that? Like, you, you gotta... I didn't get the control, that's why I just didn't, it just didn't work that way. Mission completed. I can't believe you were able to destroy a golem. We were right, you are Zero, the legendary Riploid. Zero, is that my name? I can't remember. Just relax for a moment. You have hibernation sickness. I'm sorry for forcing you to wake up. And thank you for saving me. My name is Seal, I'm a scientist. Let's go to our base before more enemies arrive. What if I'm not the Zero you were talking about? You proved to me that you are a Zero by saving me from that golem. I mean, I guess, right? Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. We're in luck, the trans server is still active. Stand on the trans server and press, okay, got it. I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. 
Return to base, download if you can feed the elf. So we don't have anything here, but that's cool, I guess. Download elf. Okay, and then you pretty much get the return to base. Let's return to base right now. And this is like, I guess, your thing. <laughs> so in this game, Mega Man or X is supposed to be the, I would say, he's the antagonist of this game for right now. So I'm having the same issue I always had with this game back when I was growing up, is there's really no sense of direction. You pretty much just have to explore and get used to every place that you're at, which I guess to some people that's a good thing, but I guess to me it's just hard to, uh, hard to understand where we're going, you know? All right, so here we are, first mission. You pretty much just have to talk to Seal, and you're pretty much good. I am a fan of this, but I forgot how the Z Saber is so weak in this game, dude. I keep forgetting about that. I just wish it wasn't the case. Gotta keep pushing, gotta keep pushing. Whoa! Okay. I'm trying to get as much health back as possible, but these guys are just not making it easy for the boy. The one big drawback in playing this game on this version is I'm so used to like the A and B's and the the Game Boy controls, how the Game Boy feels or whatever. It still feels like a regular <laughs> Playboy. It's like a regular Game Boy game. It's, it's either a good thing or a bad thing. I don't know. Through the shutter, you reach the disposal center. Okay, well, here you go. Well, there you have it. I'm here now, finally. Jesus Christ. And once I get used to these controls, hello. I am Aztec Falcon. Harpuya, the guardian, sent me to clean up. Help! Help me! You must be some of the garbage. <laughs> Just in time, I dispose of both of you together. Yeah, all right. Damn, nigga. Damn! Okay! God damn it, okay. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. God damn it! Okay! Come on, dog. Come on, bro. Come on, dog. This is you. Come on, Nick. This is you. Come on. 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 Come on! Oh my goodness. Okay. He's gonna die! Die! There you go. Jesus Christ! I was only one shot away from getting killed myself. Jesus! Thank you. I never expected someone would come to rescue me. Thank you so much. I'm still in shock. <laughs> I'll return to our boss when I'm able to walk again. You can go back now. I'll be fine. Oh my goodness, Jesus Christ. Okay, I think I'm gonna end this right here. This video is kind of, this recording is kind of long already. Thank you so much for watching.